thanks so much for joining. Today I'm going to show you how to download your SVGs and PNGs from Etsy. From your Etsy login page, go ahead and click on the profile icon. Click on purchases and reviews. For this example, I'm just going to scroll down to a design that I purchased back in the fall. Once you find the design you want, click on download files. The next screen will bring you to your downloads and just scroll down to make sure that you're on the correct design. I am going to choose the SVG zip option. That way I can download everything that the seller has sent to me. That's downloading. I'm going to head over to Canva and I am going to create a design. And I always open a t-shirt uh, design just because that's what I create the most. All right, so now you have to go to your open documents tab and then scroll up to downloads and find your new download and click on it. And then you want to find the file and you're going to have to click on extract all. When you extract files from a zipped folder, there is a new folder that's created with the same name, which contains the individual files. So basically you're copying them out of one big file into some single files. It shouldn't take too long, depending on how many images that you've purchased and how many designs that you need to download. After everything is finished um, being extracted, you can go back and find the single files. And I'm going to grab the PNG because that's what I work with the most. You can just click and drag and drop into Canva. I like PNGs because they come out with no backgrounds, which makes it easier and saves a step when I'm making t-shirts and making my designs. This next step that I do, I edit my images usually most of the time and I'll make a video to explain um, all the details but what I like to do is um, I like to make my image big so I can see how my color is changing but I go to edit image and then adjust my brightness contrast and saturation and it just helps print a darker more bold black for sublimation last step is to download I make sure PNG is clicked transparent background and the page number I want and then click on download. Thanks for watching. If this has been helpful, please consider subscribing for more video updates.